What's going on guys? Today I want to do a quick review of this Sony Calibration mic. In this review, I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about this mic, including one thing that you should know before buying. So we bought this Calibration mic um, because I'm dumb, honestly. That's kind of what it is. Uh, it came with the Calibration mic. Uh, my receiver did. But I threw it away. Um, so when I threw it away, I just didn't really realize what it was for, which was pretty dumb of me. Uh, but now we got this one, which as you could see, hooks directly up to the receiver that we have here. So I'm gonna show you how this works really quick. Um, it's pretty simple to do. First thing you wanna do is you wanna to try to put this in the middle of the room where you are going to be sitting. So ideally it would be like at or like ear level up here. Um, I'll put it just a little bit lower. So I'm gonna put it here and set it up with the book. Okay, so we're set up here and you see that you obviously wanna keep the mic open, right? Next thing that we wanna do is we want to walk over to here and on my receiver, we need to go into here and we need to do the AMP menu and the auto cal, which is auto calibrate. We'll press enter, enter on auto cal, and we'll press enter one more time. It's gonna start and you're gonna hear in a second here, this is what it does when it calibrates. And that's it. So for us, what this really helped with our issue was we have a center speaker that we had to mount uh, behind the TV, uh, just the way that everything is laid out. We tried to do it on a, you know, on an angle, et cetera, et cetera. Nothing else would work. So we mounted it behind the TV and we had to calibrate to make sure that the volume of voices in movies was good when we were using it. Um, and previously, without this calibration, it wasn't working. Now it works really, really well. So yeah, guys, good quality product. Uh, the only issue with it that I noticed was that, um, and as you may have seen when I was setting it up, the cord is about 15 feet long. So if you have something that's further than that, you may need to consider getting an extension or some other cord to use it. Um, that would be my only thing that I said would, you know, has issues with it. But other than that, I think that it is a good quality product and it definitely gets the job done.